Well, here I am, uh, YouTube, uh, back on my uh, Unstuck channel. Second video today. You know, I've been researching stuff, looking around, and I saw an article uh, about taking life too seriously. And, and I like this when it says, look at us with our grumpy faces, lack of humor, 101 problems, and our desire to make it in the world. You know, it says, seriously, is there anything more goofy than that? Sometimes it's time to look at children for some wisdom. Now, I don't see a problem with uh, working toward bettering yourself and, and uh, if you want to say making it. I, I think making a life that you want, yeah. But, uh, you know, the gist of that is don't, we, I mean, got to go to work. You got, you got, got your work. You got to do this. You got to get that done. You, I, I got this. This here could happen. That could happen. Holy fuck. I'm all worked up, you know, I'm pissed off, you know, all of this shit, you bastards, scum, you know, yeah, you know, it, you know, uh, now, I, I don't know if I said this in the last video, I'm not going to go back over the video and, and look at it, and, but maybe I'm going to reiterate, and, and you heard this before, but I had a problem with my, uh, uh, hot water heater and everything, it blew fuses, and, the tiny space you have, you know, just pissed me off. I was in a rage, but I had to move forward and fix it, and I had the ability to fix it. But uh, it's just, you, you get all bent out of shape. And instead of stepping back and going, and going, okay, I know what I need to do. It's easy, okay? I need to go, uh, I have glass fuses, okay, 30 amp. Okay, because it's 220, 240, okay, so so you need a heavier, uh, uh, a fuse that can handle a heavier load. So, I had that, okay. I have a basement, I have a home that's damp, receptacle for that fuse was corroded to the point where I had to tear it all out. All right, boom. Sure, the space is small, and I got big hands, but... Uh, you know, and you have to figure out, you know, how to get that screw in there. Uh, put on the end, put on the end of your uh, screwdriver, and then slowly, slowly try to get it angled right so that when you do put it down, that it drops right in the hole. Uh, I think I used a needle nose. I did that with a needle nose, but yeah. Um, You know, it's, it was important to get that going because I needed hot water. I had to wash dishes. I had to take a shower. I have to do wash. And for a second, I was entertaining the idea of not going through the whole mess and heating water whenever I needed water. Just that, I mean, and I know there you guys out there, you're going, yeah, I have entertained them ideas too. Yes, you do. It's kind of like, this shit, I don't need this shit. I'm just going to heat water for the rest of my life, okay? But, yeah, I mean, there are things that I really hate that I'm trying to work on that I do have the ability to change my situation. But while I'm working at stuff to change my situation... You know, I'm getting all bent out of shape over shit, and then I got to talk myself down. You know, and, and that's the thing. I got to even look at situations like that and laugh and go, all right, whatever. Because you get yourself stressed out, and then you know what you don't do? What you should be doing. Why? Especially if it's something that is not in the, I need to do this file. 
that job, I needed to do that. So that was like, okay, I got to get this out of the in and put it in the out. I have to. I got to get that done. Then there are other things. It's like, I don't need to get that in the out. I, It ain't really in. Even though you tell yourself, I'd like to do that. You know, and then you get yourself stressed out over the fact that you're not doing it. I'm still doing this. I'd like to do that, but you'd like to do that? You know, what are you, fucking handcuffed? Did they chain you up? Did they nail you to a wall? You know, you're blind? You, did they blind you? Or what What happened? Are you, are you crippled? Mentally crippled? Or are you physically crippled? You can't? If you don't have any of them problems, then you can't. But there you are, taking everything way too serious. You're all puckered up. Yeah. And yeah, I mean, some of this stuff that I'm learning is way out of my, what I'm used to. And it's going to take me a while. But as I'm going through it, I'm getting basic, I, I'm getting an idea of what it is. And, and, and the more I work at it, the better it's going to, you know, become. The first time I hooked up two lights to one switch, uh, it kind of looks like crap. It works, but compared to the second time that I did it, and I'm going to have to go back over that. And that's one of the things I'm putting off. I have the wire, instead of going up this way, I have it just going up that way because I was, you know, I was getting kind of, you know, toward the end when I was hooking up the last light. You know, it was like, well, I'll just throw it up this way and everything like that. But, you know, the second time I did it, great, looks good. So, you know, and that's the thing. I mean, if, you know, that was like, what, a couple years after I did the first two lights. And I haven't done anything like that for a while. So what... Well, what am I going to do? The same thing I did with the second uh, pair of lights is I just walked over. I unscrewed the box. I looked at how everything was hooked up, and then I went and hooked it up. But with other things, it's, it, I'm trying to go over it and over it and over it and figure it out and go back over it and, and, and however long it takes. But, and yeah, am I going to get irritated? Yes, I am. I'm going to get irritated, especially if, I learned something and I suddenly forgot it, slipped my mind. I'm like, damn it. But I can't take that too seriously. Okay. Uh, take the situation we're in in this country. I, I'm one of those who says, no, voting ain't going to get us out of this. Something else entirely different is going to, has the possibility to get us out of this. You know, but even that, I get myself all friggin' in a rage over the tyranny and all the bullshit. But I gotta take myself, I gotta take it less serious than I normally take it because there's there's something I can't really control. Okay. Um. The only way I can control that is by not letting it get me to a point where I'm in a rage over it. Okay? I, I'm getting my tax bill next month. Just just the thought of that makes me almost, you know, my head blow off the top of my, off my shoulders. You know? I mean, I want to, things I'd like to do to certain people. But... I, I, that's another thing. I got to stay calm. You know, I have the money to pay it. So I'm going to pay it. But yeah. I mean, taking ourselves way too serious, taking situations to where, yeah, if, if, if it's a bad situation, it's good to be concerned about. 
but even then it's good to kind of just go okay i i you, you find a solution and then you work if you can do it you work at that at solving the problem if you can't there is still a solution because there's someone out there that can possibly help you solve that problem so there you go i believe there's a solution to every problem i mean there is a solution if it's a problem there's a solution to it you know and uh sometimes it's not going to be immediate that job i had to do was immediate boom i solved the problem got everything back the water is hot there are other times that there are solutions to problems that are there but right now i don't have the money for that solution because i'm gonna have to go have someone else solve that problem for me so oh well whatever but yeah you know just uh taking life seriously too seriously i mean that's the thing with uh that's the thing with kids uh one of the things that i i see with a child is uh with children is they are very honest and uh, one of the things that really irritates me is how adults will tell the children to not be honest a child will come out and tell you that you're x y or z and then the adult will go well that ain't nice uh you know if a kid would come up to me and go, I, you're ugly. All right, boom. You don't like it. You know, I'm used to it. So it ain't going to bother me. You know, and then an adult would say, uh, oh, well, you don't say that. And I'm like, what are you talking about? I don't give a damn if the kid said that. Okay. I mean, are there ways to change your looks? Well, yeah, you can, uh, if, you, if you're too heavy, you can lose weight. You can lift weights, you can whatever. I mean, but yeah. Yeah, don't take life too seriously. I mean, because uh, there are people that have taken life that serious, it stressed them the frig out and they ended up dead. I mean, and I, I did that for years. You know, just every little thing that hit me the wrong way just was like a, in a rage. And I'm getting better as I get older because I finally got to a point where I uh, became aware of it and started identifying uh, whether it was worth getting uh, worked up over. And But then again, I, I, I let myself go. And uh, just keep in a rage and, and stuff like that. Heck, what, 2018, which was six years ago, I gave myself a belly button hernia because I was in that much of a rage after coming home from work that I just blew up and just was yelling at the top of my lungs and boom, belly button hernia. Now, that was coming on for a while. And I deserved it. Yeah. Uh, I still have it, too. It doesn't really affect me. It affected me more when I was a 280-pound fat ass. But, you know, then it would pop out quite a bit. But now that I lost the weight, yeah. But, yeah. And, and I, you know, I still get, uh, you know, it, it isn't going to be like you're going to be like, Oh, well, I'm taking life less serious now, so boom, I'm glad that's over. No, you're going to have to work at it like everything. But, yeah, you know, just, you know, sigh of relief and just laugh. <laughs> Whatever, you know. No use crying over spilled milk. Yeah. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. Now, I'm not really, a, you know, I'm, I'm on a pretty much mostly carnivore diet, so I 
drink lemonade, I guess, every now and then. It never was really my favorite. I mean, if it's just the lemons, but that there is kind of bitter. And since I don't, I try to ingest uh, less, a lot less sugar than I used to, because sugar and cancer are good friends. They love each other, you know. But, well, that's about it. Uh, I didn't think I was going to make uh, any, I didn't know that I was going to make any more videos on this channel, but I'm getting ideas. So uh, maybe I'll make another one because I'm going to continue in the vein I was going today, and that'll probably give me another idea. So uh, yeah, don't take life too serious. Okay, so uh, until next time. This is Dave Kramer, and this is Kramer Unstuck.